Shakara Dickens reported Lauren missing eight days after she says she willingly gave the baby to a middle-aged white woman. I did have a conversation with her last week uh, through the door of her apartment, but she did not appear uh, upset at all. She said she was interested in finding her baby, didn't know where the baby was, and didn't know anything about the lady who supposedly took the baby, but she uh, did not seem distraught in the slightest. And tonight, 19-year-old Shakara Dickens, who again waited eight days to report that her baby is missing. Well, tonight you can see the shot there. She's wearing a nice orange jumpsuit as she's being moved after she was having a nice discussion with homicide Not detectives, and then they walked suit. her over to the jail. She's being held now on possible aggravated child abuse charges, and again, at this point, is being investigated, looked into, given the fact that her daughter has not been seen for some time. Let's go to our callers if we could. Let's go to Dale from California. Dale, what's your question tonight? Thanks, Rita. Um, where is her family? If they're not living with her, are they in the area? Are they outside the area? I mean, it seems that she is entirely alone. Well, well, Dale, the baby daddy is behind bars. Uh, this is a, a really nice character. He has a rap sheet a mile long, in fact, for a burglary, um, a whole bunch of different charges. But let's go to Jason Miles. He's our reporter with the uh, CNN affiliate WMC who's outside the jail. Where's the rest of her family? Where's her mother, father, sisters, brothers? This is a question that keeps coming up, Rita, and I can try to explain here what, from what I've heard from uh, other uh, friends and acquaintances, neighbors in the apartment complex, what we've uh, heard uh, through tips to our station. I understand uh, Shakara's mother has custody uh, in, a, in a loose way, perhaps not a legal way, of her other child, an older boy, I understand, between three and five years old, Lauren's older brother. The rumor is, and this is unconfirmed right now, just speculation, is that uh, Shakara asked her mother to take care of a Lauren. The mother says, I'm already overwhelmed. I have basically taken care of your son. I don't have uh, the uh, you know, resources for this. And that's kind of when all this other stuff started. I don't know if she was looking for a way to uh, get out of this situation with her young daughter. But uh, that's what we've been hearing uh, through the grapevine, if you will. Uh, still no excuse. I mean, this is just shameful. No excuse. Let's go to Wendy Walsh, if we could, psychologist. You know, and like you said, this is sort of like the excuse. Let's get rid of it. I covered the Susan Smith case. And, you know, it was, oh, woe is me. I was having these troubles. No excuse. Well, no excuse for sure, but let me tell you, she is a teenage mother who probably had a baby at 14. I mean, you know, Wendy, I don't care. I don't care. I don't feel sorry for her. I don't care.